Ben Victor and John Randall described this beautiful new species of grandma in zoological studies in 2010. At that time, there were no underwater photos of this fish. The golden fairy basslet, Grandma de Young Eye, was originally collected on reefs near the city of Trinidad, Cuba. But on our trip in May 2018, we were diving in the Cuba Marine Sanctuary called Jardines de la Reina, or Gardens of the Queen. We made our first checkout dive here at Anclitas. Marge is here in the foreground, and with only a few minutes, she found our first golden fairy basslet. And here it is, just a very small juvenile swimming among a much larger group of its close relative, the royal grandma. To my great surprise, a few minutes later, Marge found this adult golden fairy basslet. I didn't expect to see them in water only 55 feet deep. We thought they'd be found much deeper. Watch the behavior of this golden fairy basslet at the end of this clip. I've never seen its relative, the royal grandma, behave like this coming right up to the lens. We expected the golden fairy basslet to be down here in deeper water around 100 feet along with its other relative, the black cap basslet, but we never found them this deep. The five golden basslets we observed were all at depths between 45 feet to 75 feet. Nor did we find them up here on shallow reefs at the upper depth range of the Royal Grandma. I have never dived on reefs where Royal Grandma were so abundant almost everywhere we dived. Look at this little fish which has a most unusual color pattern with a lot more purple on its head. Very likely, this is a hybrid between the golden fairy basslet and the royal grandma, and most likely the first such hybrid ever observed. This dive site is called Five Seas, and typical of most of the dives here, we were accompanied the entire time by Caribbean reef sharks. Our dive guide is pointing to a golden fairy basslet. He's indicating it's an adult fish, and rubbing his fingers together means gold. Marge already has it in her camera sights, but this fish was rather skittish and hard to capture on video. Not too far away, we found another adult golden fairy basslet. We only had GoPro 5 cameras on this dive trip, but with a plus 10 close-up lens and a very cooperative fish, we were able to get some good shots. I'll just let the rest of this video play on for the next minute and a half. Again, these are some of the first video sequences of this rare new species in the wild. Thank <laughs> you. 